Biden just reclassified the Kennedy documents 60 years after his assassination. No one even peripherally involved is still alive. So what could possibly be the sources and methods that were supposedly showing the world by declassifying these are so outdated they're irrelevant. They were using disappearing ink in 1963. Why in the world would we be continuing to hide the truth about the Kennedy assassination 60 years later? And of course, the answer is obvious because it implicates not individuals, but institutions and and reveals them as complicit in a, in a murder and in the overthrow of the U.S. government. And uh, the U.S. government is complicit in the overthrow of the U.S. government. And that's the truth. I, I know that for a fact because I interviewed someone who saw the document. And so, you know, we have a long way. Look, the bottom line is, unless there is a compelling reason that relates to imminent physical security of citizens, we should never hide the truth from the population in a democracy, period. Because that's, that is incompatible with democracy. Secrecy is incompatible with democracy. How can I, I'm running the government, but you can't tell me what the government's doing? That's, that's not democracy, that, that's it's something else. And don't insult me by calling it a democracy because it's very much not. And so, yes, there is much that remains secret. I'm not going to speculate. You don't need to be a conspiracy nut. We have, in the United States, we have over a billion federal documents that remain classified. A billion. Going back to the Second World War. That's a democracy? That is not a democracy.